Hey guys, this is Alicia, and I want to share this with you. I made this for a very special friend, and I'm used to doing things for women. Shabby chic, girly, even steampunk. You know, when it's for a girl, you can always throw a metal flower and it looks cute. But this is for a guy friend, so it was a little tough for me to come up with the concept. But I did want to make a picture frame, and I found this box at a thrift shop. And I'll show you guys here. Um, sorry, I probably should have taken the mirrors off. I'm going to put some pictures in there for him. But um, the first one, I'll see if I can get a little close here. Um, I used some paint. I was going to use just regular paint, but I, I actually used... Um, markers, metal markers for this because I wanted it to look like old scribble and old. So I made this out of, um, this wing was a metal embellishment. I made a mold and then I made a clay piece with it. And then I put a key, a little, um, I think it's like a fleur, uh, fleur de lis little charm in there and what else is in here I put smiles for a picture in here and then here I made um, I know he likes um, dream catchers so um, I put a dream catcher let's see if I can focus here I made a dream catcher out of it um, some old earrings that I had and then I cut these out I actually use different papers. I can't remember which ones. I just try to find things that didn't look too girly. Then I um, put memories here in the bottom. And I made this little chain with some charms. Uh, at the time, now, um, I used... You know, he, we work together, so this is kind of related to our job, so I know he'll... Whoa. Sorry, no, my phone is not focusing here. Come on. No, it's mad at me. Now, I found this on a paper. There we go. It says, Love and Friendship. I really like that. It's like a crossword puzzle, and it was part of the paper, so I'll put that in there. Little charms and medals, and back to this. And then my favorite part is the top. Um, I used this. Um, I got these handles for my albums, but since it was really hard to like take this on and off, I wanted to put a little handle. So let's see right now. Gotta make sure it's just right. There we go. So I, I grabbed this handle. I figured it would use to pick it up because it's also a box on the inside. And also it's decoration. So I put happy and I cut these out of paper and use a scrabble piece for this. And I really like how vintage this looks. So I put some cute and some gears with paint. And this is just... um. I think that's from Michael's, that keyhole little charm. So, but anyway, I um, just wanted to show you guys that it wasn't easy, but here's maybe some ideas if you want to make a guy's gift. This um, is really fun. I try to keep the colors the same so it wouldn't look, um, it wouldn't look super busy. I wanted everything to kind of blend it together. And, um, sorry, no, it's not focusing. But, um, here we go. Maybe um, this will inspire you guys if you have to make a guy's gift. Um, there's, there's a lot of, there's a lot of papers that, especially all those of steampunk or vintage papers that have some, some things that we can use for boys. So I hope you guys liked it. And uh, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.